Yo, what is going on guys? This is Swerve here and welcome back to another Jurassic World 3 video. So, yesterday's news on the fact that Jurassic World 3 will be delayed for a whole new year. Um, something that I didn't say in that video, but I did think actually for my personal understanding. The reason why they wanted to delay uh, the production of this movie is simply because just in case the cast do or any st staff members do get COVID, that they definitely know that they have a lot of time frame to work with rather than seven months to work with. And unfortunately, that has just happened. I'll split speak about that a little bit later in the video but we're going to start on with a positive note right here so jurassic world actually tweeted out something about the covid test and which i'll speak in a second but not only that they did post on twitter a new image of our first ever non-dinosaur land creature yes ladies and gentlemen please welcome the lystrosaurus to jurassic world this is a early a late permian and early triassic Creature is not a dinosaur, but it is a creature, which is very interesting to say the least. I believe is it is a deictodontid. I think that's how you say it. And the deictodons or deictodons were actually in uh, Primeval on an ITV show based in England. Um, that was very cool and showed loads of dinosaurs and uh, creatures from the prehistoric times and uh, Diectodon was actually there and a Lystrosaurus I believe is of the same species as the Diectodon and it was also in a uh, show called Walking with Monsters if you guys remember that uh, there's probably a few clips in the background but yes we finally get to see the Lystrosaurus as confirmed by Colin Trevorrow that it is the Lystrosaurus as well but that is very cool finally we have a well, land creature that's not a dinosaur in Jurassic World. What does this mean? Because in Camp Cretaceous, spoiler alert, we actually heard that Dr. Wu found Siberian mammoth, mammoth remains for a project that he wants to do. Could we be seeing a woolly mammoth as well be happening? We know they're f filming in cold winter. Maybe we could be seeing a mammoth. I don't know about that. But again, some early morning news here for you guys. And Lystrosaurus has been confirmed to be in Jurassic World. A little small creature that um, apparently likes to chew through wires, according to Nick Cutter from Primeval. Um, but yes, it's a diectodontid, and I'm very excited to say the least. However, this image came with some sad, sad news. Jurassic World then tweeted out saying, Late last night we were informed that the Jurassic World Dominion production team experienced a small amount of positive tests for COVID-19. Even though subsequent tests proved negative this morning due to our rigged protocols to ensure the safety and well-being of our staff. The entire cast and crew is paramount at all times. Those who initially tested positive are currently self-isolating, as are those who came in contact with them. As a result, filming has temporarily been paused and will resume in accordance with established safety guidelines, which means for two weeks there will be no filming, possibly no editing as well, for Jurassic World Dominion, which is a little bit sad. However, they have all of this time until 2022 now, so just for this exact reason, I believe, is the reason why they did want to push it back. It was, it was almost inevitable that eventually a staff member working on the movie was going to test positive and maybe, just maybe, it could spread along the rest of the crew and staff. Fingers crossed it doesn't. I really wish the safety and best for everybody working on this movie. But potentially the virus could spread, so that's why I believe that they did want to push it back to 2022 in case this happens and in case they have to keep self-isolating and only God Lord knows what exactly is going to happen. But yes, yeah, so the main thing to take from here is that we have a diectodontid, the list Lystrosaurus coming to Jurassic World, very exciting to say the least, and the fact that Jurassic World Dominion's production has halted for two weeks uh, to stay safe and uh, hopefully people do take precaution around this protocol and they really do stay safe out there and don't contract the virus in any way possible and uh, just fingers crossed that they are going to be okay. But you know, some good news and some bad news here, but um, you know, at the end of the day, they did push it back to 2022 and personally, I do believe that maybe that is because uh, just in case a positive case was to be confirmed which was almost inevitable considering how fast cases are going up around the world but in the meantime hope you guys have enjoyed today's short little video if you did enjoy today's video make sure to smash that like button if you want a video with just describing what the list the saurus is and what you guys think of it and some you know generic facts about it and where we could see it in the movie do let me know in the comment section down below and i'll make a whole video saying what is the list saurus in jurassic world blah 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 stuff like that and what does this mean or something like that but in the meantime, hope you guys have enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe, all that good stuff. We are closing in on 17,000. And if you want to help out, you know, 80% of you aren't subscribed watching this. So go on, smash that subscribe button and help me out just a little bit extra. But in the meantime, take care. Love you all. Stay safe out there. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.